So this week's video is gonna be a little bit different. It is an entirely handheld phone camera video where I talk about my travel station or the battle station I use while traveling for work. Now, the reason for this video is that there is a massive snowstorm going through the Canadian US border right now. It is hitting a lot of places. It is dumping a ton of snow and I fully expect it to be trapped in Chicago over the weekend. I was lucky and I was able to grab an earlier flight than I was supposed to originally have. And that flight was one of the last ones to fly out. So I did get home, but I thought there was no point in me getting rid of this video. And I thought I may as well show you, it's something that I am still interested in. It's just not gonna be at the quality that this kind of video is. It is a entirely handheld, recorded on my Note 10 Plus in a relatively dark hotel room. So keep that one in mind when you watch it. And without further ado, Let's check it out. First off, we got a little uh, 30 watt uh, block charger from Anchor. Uh, USB-C, I have this USB-C cable. That's pretty nice. And that just sits right by the bed. And it's basically like my go-to little bed charger. I then have my bag, and this is actually a different bag than I normally use. And the reason I'm using this bag is because I have both laptops with me. Both laptops, well, that laptop uh, won't fit in any of my other bags at all because it's huge, it's 17 inches. So I have to use this bag. And the bigger laptop goes into the back pocket and my work laptop goes into the front pocket where the keyboard is currently sitting. May as well go through this. So I have my MX Keys Mini. I use this almost exclusively for work. It is fantastic. I do a lot of typing uh, while I'm traveling for work, and this makes life so much easier. I just have a hard time typing on laptop keyboards. And in here, I have a whole bunch of cables, and I have my portable power bank that I always carry around, the 26,800 milliamp one. Lifesaver a lot of the time. I can even use it to charge my laptops which is great. Um, nothing else really of interest in there. It's just a lot of cables, a lot of chargers, um, a lot of stolen napkins since everybody always forgets to give me utensils and napkins whenever I order food. So lots of that in there. And then yeah, got a spot for my water bottle there. Uh, I got some snacks. I got some pizza uh, or you know casserole, whatever you want to call it. I got my work laptop. Um, I have MX Master um, that I use for work, and both of these connect to the same, this and the keyboard connect to the same dongle on the laptop. It's very helpful. Um, and then I have my 100 watt U Green charging this laptop most of the time uh, when I'm at the office. It's using, a, it's using the same charger for everything, and it's using a cable. Works perfectly. And then I don't have to carry around a whole bunch of chargers, which is really nice. I don't have to carry a laptop charger for this one. I often keep an Xbox controller in there in case my friends want to play things like Rocket League and stuff. Only really if I'm traveling with this. Oftentimes I'll end up traveling with the Steam Deck instead. But that's only if I'm playing games on my own. If I'm playing games with a lot of friends and I'm going to be here for like a whole week, I'll usually try to bring this laptop. It just makes things easier. And the reason I don't bring around... This laptop all too often is one it's huge two its charger is massive if I put the controller like you know it is a massive charging block um, so that often actually goes into my roller carry-on because I don't want the, all that extra weight in my backpack the keyboard actually when I'm traveling and on the plane usually goes into the roller bag as well anything that I can offload off the backpack into the roller bag, I try to do that. So, yep, there's that. For my headset, I use my noise canceling headphones, the Sony WH-1000XM4s. Um, they are fantastic, I love them. In Bluetooth mode, however, they are really bad on computers with using the microphone and all that kind of stuff. So. I have a Vmoda Boom Pro, 
uh, plugged into them and that's the way I use them when I'm using it on the computer, whether it's on my personal computer or on my work laptop. For calls, I'll use it with the Vmoda Boom Pro. This thing is awesome. I have like three or four of these. I recommend them all the time. It allows you to use really nice headphones as a headset. Um, I use this exclusively as my headset for a really long time with one of my other headphones. And yeah, it is fantastic. It's a great option. Mouse for the gaming computer. I'm using a Death Adder. Which one is it? The Death Adder Hyperspeed. This is the cheaper one that uses a AA battery inside. Um, it's just an easy one to travel around with me. And it has a spot for the dongle, which is nice. And then I have this Razer mouse pad that I bought for like 2 or $3. And that goes in the bag as well. And this box doesn't normally travel with me, obviously. Uh, but it has got a lot of really fun goodies in there. So get subscribed if you want to see what I'm doing with the items in here. As well as all these cables. They're all kind of interconnected. And my roller bag just kind of gets all my clothes and anything I don't want to carry in the backpack, basically. Uh, it's a Travel Pro. Very nice roller bag. And yeah, I mean, this is the basic setup that I have normally going on. I'll typically have my work laptop on all the time because at any time someone will message me for work-related things, so I just have it on. And the only thing I'm really missing from this is my laptop stand that I showed in my what's in my bag video. I normally do travel with that. I just forgot to pack it this time. I was in a little bit of a rush. Now, there are going to be some upcoming changes, specifically with this charger. Um, so stay subscribed. Check out next week's video. I'm going to be talking about that. Um, I was supposed to be talking about it this week, but some complications came up, so it's going to be for next week's video. And, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. I travel quite a bit for work as of late, every, you know, five to six weeks, it seems. Um, it's probably going to slow down quite a bit for a while. But, yeah, I mean, traveling with the gaming laptops kind of a pain in the butt. Um, before that, I was just traveling around with my Steam Deck. And obviously you can't be installing games on my work laptop, so that's why I carry these around. And yeah, I mean, the, the laptop's great. It cosplays as a jet turbine a lot of the time. It's really, really loud. So that's also why having those headphones is nice, because I can just block out all that sound. And, yeah, I mean, I, I'm trying to slim down my bag as much as possible without making my life any less convenient while I travel for work. And, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. If you got any questions about any of the things I bring with me, feel free to let me know. As always, I will have links for everything that I mentioned down in the description. Those will be affiliate links most likely. So if you do use them, they really do help with the channel, but you're not obligated to. And I really do hope that this very different video was helpful. And if not, I at least hope you found it interesting. If you did, I'd really appreciate it. If you like, subscribe. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback, you can leave those down in the comment section below and I will try to get to them all as quickly as I can. Big thanks to my patron sponsors, Thoughts, Lime, and Step Back, and thank you for watching the end of this video. If you do want to see any of the other videos relating to my setups and things that I'm using, you can go ahead and check out this playlist right up here. And as always, stay safe out there. See you next time.